this video we are going to see how we can design a wordpress website using all free resources like free theme free plugins so the website that we are going to create it will look something like this okay so it will have all the necessary sections and pages that we need to get started we can use as a personal portfolio website and the first step we are going to install our wordpress to do that we need to log into our domain and hosting provider as i am using namecheap so i already logged in and i am on my hosting list so after that i just clicked here go to cpanel as we are going to install the wordpress from cpanel so uh, here is my cpanel so after that we need to scroll down and need to go to softwares so here it is we need to just click on softwares and after that from here we need to select uh, we need to click on install when we will click on install it will take us to the installation page so these are the most important settings from here where it says software setup uh, here it's showing if we have ssl in our plan we need to choose ssl from here like it will install ssl automatically like and it will show a padlock like this but if we not have any any ssl in our plan then we need to continue with http so i have ssl so i will continue with https so after that this is my domain on which i am going to install the wordpress so after that this is if we want to install wordpress in subdirectory then we need to uh, write the subdirectory here but i want to install the wordpress on main domains so here here we go so after that here it is this is wordpress login detail that we need to set up so for the username i like to have admin and after that you can set up your password so now as you can see it's creating a login for me automatically for the email like it will be my email from uh, hosting provider and i can log in and to manage but if you want to use your own email or gmail account you can write up here so after that i, I am just copying this password so we can log in and after that you can ignore these all these settings so just click on install now it will take few minutes to install our page as you can see here it usually take three to four minutes okay uh, that's it relations so our wordpress is installed as you can see and the wordpress is installed successfully so let's see how it's looking as you can see this is wordpress default theme to log in we need to use this url okay so now let's log into our wordpress website to log in as you can see it's logged in automatically but let me log in again using my uh, username and password as you can see it's already okay so let's log in okay now we, we can see we are logged in successfully and this is our default page like it's a default theme uh, when we install our wordpress and it's come along with it now let's go to the second step in the second step now we will install the theme and required plugin to do that let's log in let's come here appearance and go to themes and from and from here we need to search for astra theme okay click on add new a most popular wordpress theme that is astra theme so why we are going to use astra theme because this is very lightweight and a top rated theme so now we uh, as you can see as we just have installed the theme and you will see the appearance of the website is changed this is because of the theme that we have installed so now let's install the plugins as you can see the appearance of the website is changed so now we need to install a uh, plugin so we can use a demo so we just need to click here so okay get started when we will click here it will install and activate the required plugin for the website for to uh, so we can use a starter templates so okay so now we are going to import a demo content as we already installed this plugin so just click here build your website and after that we need to select a page builder so we are going to use elementor that is wordpress famous page builder okay so from here we can choose many different available templates right there are portfolio and cv website as you can see uh, the it's come with pre-made free to use template that are very beautiful this one this one and this one these are three free and this one is premium so i am going to use this one so i just need to click here and after that it will give us the preview of how the site will look and I am now just clicking skip and continue 
and after that we need to choose a color scheme for our website we can choose any color scheme i just want to keep the default color scheme and you can also select the font and colors from here but i will um, keep the default so after that I, I just click continue and now it's saying okay just plus one step tell us a bit more so they will send us a uh, promotional emails but let me see if we continue with it okay so i have just clicked on uh, build our site so as you can see now they are installing the required plugin like wp form elementor and the other uh, uh, plugin like starter templates and after that they installing the plugins they will import the site content images media appearance menu images and all that stuff and in the in the third step they will like set up our kit our pages and on the fourth step it will make sure our website is ready so now let's wait for it to finish okay perfect as you can see the installation is finished so now we we need to look how our website is looking as you can see in just few minutes we able to create a very beautiful and stunning website okay as you can see we have many sections here we have our services we have our work experience we have our portfolio sections and client feedbacks and a very beautiful subscribe button and a footer so we uh, did this in just few minutes so now if you want to customize any section of your website so just click here edit with elementor and it will take us to this page okay so let's suppose if you want to customize this like i am a web developer so if you just want to you just have to click on that element and it will open the editing sidebar on the left side so you can change anything from here like this okay and here we go if you want to change the style and color of your element you just need to go to click here styles and after that you can change the text color from here like any any color you can choose okay so that's it